what is going on boys and girls of youtube we're back at it we got some jungle gameplay only i'm not just doing your standard you know assassin bluestone jungle we're gonna have some fun with it i've really wanted to test out that axe of animosity so they moved animosity over to the warrior's axe i don't know what high risk is on but they're on something so i'm going to try to see how it feels in the jungle to see if it's realistic and something you can run i haven't exactly tested this yet so it should be fun if you like these videos please hit the like button make sure you subscribe to the channel let's get into this yeah 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 oh i hate it when you ask for subs and follows and likes and this and that bro if i don't tell you guys to do it nobody does it you guys forget about it you guys are too entertained so let's see what we got here uh, i'm doing it on ama i didn't mention that I tried to get Vamana gameplay in. The issue with Vamana in my mind in the jungle doing Warrior's Axe is you're, you it, it's hard to keep up with how fast your teammates die. <laughs> it sounds bad, but that's quite literally what happens in the games. Um, your teammates die so fast you can't keep up. So I'm going to see what I can do in this situation uh, with an ammo. See if we can get a little bit more out of out of uh, that warrior's axe with our ama instead of a vamana. I, or I mean, and the thing is with vamana, a tanky vamana right now. That change they made to his uh, ultimate is insane. He's so strong and so hard to kill. It is very very difficult to kill him. So don't get me wrong. I do think it's possible to still do a vamana. I just I haven't had the the. The right match to make it work to really test it out so we're gonna test out this ama haven't played any ama this season i haven't really played ama in a little while so this should be a good nice little fun match for us team comps wise man i've been having kuzimbos left and right and they've been popping off all my friends swear swear kuzimbo op <laughs> i'm not so much kuzimbo op but I've seen a lot of Kuzimbos lately, and I don't think I've lost with a Kuzimbo yet. So, uh, shout outs, you Kuzimbo mains out there. Uh, hopefully, you're having fun. Hopefully, you're doing your thing. And, they've been, and I've had a lot of solo Kuzimbos, which is like cracked out of its mind. Uh, we are going into the Golden Blade build. I don't think I'm going to level the one, though. Um, with speed buff, I will be insanely fast. But I don't think I'm going to level the one. I think I'm going to level the two and just play for the early game burst. But the auto attack build will be cracked. The auto attack build would, would be nuts. So I am going in auto attack build here. That's the overall goal. That's why we're going animosity. We're going to get a Kins. And we're just going to see how much extra everything we can get off. Up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't even know if I got my passive up there. That was crazy. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm going to take my dash off the start instead of my one. Just because I want to be able to fight here. I don't think we're gonna fight. I have a feeling I'm just gonna go for the clear. I've been we've been getting really good clear times in a lot of my matches. Yeah, we just have insane pressure right now. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this speed bar, the speed buff, the screen buff. I could invade. Wait, we left both buffs up for me. This is insane. Um. Oh no, they messed up. <laughs> That's really bad, actually. So I'm not gonna go to my green now. I would have gone straight to my green, or sorry, my speed out, out, out of that green. Enemy missing. But that's as uh, awkward as it gets. Crazy pressure. Oh. Good damage. We got first blood. Good job, gamers. Good, good, good job. This guy is so low. I don't have enough mana to 2 3, but I have enough mana to blink and just hit him with a fat too but he's sitting on the tower lane line so i'm just gonna clear it up and go next i'm gonna take my one here i should be zooming around the map once we are level seven just don't forget ever since they move remove boots you get more xp every level up until level seven my poseidon's going for mids which i respect but i gotta get the speed on on timer i'm gonna feel as good so far with the warriors axe i'm not gonna lie i almost forgot i had it Buffs are up really soon. I'm just going to back. Back. I'm going to get my tier two. It's really good to get your tier two. If you get an early kill, you can definitely go for the full items like a Jotun's or the full Golden Blade. But in a situation like this, I like getting the tier two online. 
Um, in case we fight right at level five, which I'm not gonna have an item there. We'll go for midwave here too. Look at how fast I am. The tier on tier action. Awkward. And you lose a one v one mirror match. Oh my gosh, that damage is actually sick. Warriors axe, baby. <laughs> Only for 35. <laughs> I'm gonna try to invade here. Uh, oh, sorry. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna invade blue. Watch over us, dear Phoenix. Ward on red. We'll go for his blue since he's losing lane. The flames protect me. <gasps> that cleared. Oh my gosh, what a beast. What a beast. I don't know how his two just cleared though. I guess that's just bluestone uh bluestone tier. That's mind blowing that that actually cleared that to me. Oh, okay, that's really awkward. Why do they space out so much? We're all good. We want to back here anyway. Make sure you always grab camps while you're running through the jungle. All these these camps that are roaming, you want to try to kill them as much as possible. You don't want to be leaving them up. Gotta pop a health body, that's rough. Could have definitely just stand swapped. Um, rough life. Two to two. I gotta get in on, on, on this. Oh no. He's gonna be up soon, right? I need the. Nope, this camp's not even close to being up. We have the gold though, we're just back. It sucks it only gives 10 gold for the small ones early game, but it is what it is. It'd be a little OP if it was giving too much gold. Oh, too bad. <laughs> Sorry for coughing. I still am like, I had COVID and it was kind of bad for like a week, but this cough won't go away. Like, I'm good, but the cough won't go away. Kind of frustrating. Um, speed's not quite up yet. It's going to be up here in a second, but I don't want the Kazimbo waiting with me. So we're going to go over here. We're going to grab. Oh, not even up yet. Everything takes so long to respawn. Come on. Be careful, right on my way. I'm gonna go help. Yes, yes. Yes. Bro, you should not be getting this low, but it is what it is. Enemy missing middle. Be careful, right? Come on, Gazebo. There you go. He's committed the war dude. He's committed. He just got turned on good rotation from a Poseidon. He did no damage to me. I don't know if you see this. He I stand swap, so I was healing a little bit, I think. Wait, no, I didn't. I tooed. I tooed. So uh, you know, we were we were uh reducing a little bit of damage there, but that man did zero damage to us. Look at how fast I am. Oh my gosh. This guy is committed. No, it hurts. Live. My flame has not been healing flame yet. A loyal act for the house of the Phoenix. No! He got his two back up. I missed time that. I think he dies. If Kazimba doesn't mess up here, he dies. Oh, that's rough. That's rough. That's rough. It's okay though. I I honestly am not too too worried about it. Uh we're gonna go to crusher next. Give ourselves a little bit of pen, give us power, give us the attack speed. And then I'm probably gonna go into an early kins. Like almost guaranteed going into an early kins. Come on. This guy traded with me, so I'm not too upset, but really going the transcendence, Shibalanki build, I feel like just isn't the move. Going for that that over the top kill though was extremely bad timing with all the camp spawning. So if I'm trying to win here, I don't ever go for that soul kill. All we do is we back, take, you know, be happy about the damage. We just back and get to all this farm. This farm is really important to have on cooldown. I'm excited to get an animosity game in. To be honest with you, I've just wanted to test it out of the jungle so bad. It doesn't feel like jungle clear is solid. I don't feel like I'm falling behind. I like the push. I don't like that it's on Sylvanas. Out of mana. Oh, that's too bad. As long as we stay ahead of the Pele, we should be all right. The soul is going to be very annoying. Soul is destroying right now. 
Um, looks like he's going a damage build instead of a band cross build. You can go this Book of Thoth build, but you definitely don't have the sustain that you normally would have. What is the movement speed, man? Oh my gosh. It's actually nuts. We have the carapace too, so if we get on this guy, he will just die. Dude, we don't even have to ult. Ult if we have to, but we should. There we go, we had to ult. We really only had to ult there because our ADC was super struggling. Our ADC with this build is going to be having a struggle situation. He really should just go into Aussie. Uh, max the two instead of the one. It's a little Oops. garish. There we go. We take out fight somewhere else. We I don't even know what happened. Live, buddy, live. I'm coming. I am literally zooming. Oh my gosh. That's unfortunate. It's mainly unfortunate because if we just let me get in there to blink, it's over. Be careful, middle out of mana. A light in the darkness. The flames protect me. My soul my burns bright. Yeah. The fire. We don't need a pool. That's why we hard juke to the side. Our ult's not up either. So I'm kind of okay with just backing up a little bit here. Oh, I love this clear. Actually, it's nuts. This clear is sick. Yeah, we just back out. Our red's coming up. All of our farms coming up. There you go, buddy. Their Pele should be going to buffs, but we'll see what happens. I'm not 100% not sure on his timers and cooldowns the way he's playing the game. Oh, it reset. What? Okay, I got trolled. The speed buff is weird. I, I've been having seen this happen even when you're hitting it and keeping it in, in combat. It's not supposed to leash like that. It's supposed to, as long as you keep hitting it, it's supposed to keep following you. And it's only the speed buff. But look, it's doing it again. I've, I've seen this happen many times. There's, it's definitely bugged. You can see the way it's acting right there. Something going on. Yeah, be careful. Got to back. 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 I got you guys. Ask for wards. I got you, pal. This is a close game. It's mainly close because of me overcommitting in mid and because our Shabalanka is just building incorrectly. Never be like this, Kazimbo, leeching like that. If you're leeching from your jungler, you're asking to lose the game. Just, just so you guys understand, your jungle will be the reason you win 90% of your games. In current meta, so you should be making sure they're as big as possible. You should never be leeching from them. It's completely worthless. Love to see it. Three gold theories. Really, objectives are just are just nuts. How simple they are right now. I'm going to go do a little bit of hunting here. It looks like he, you just saw that animation, which means he just did that. Alright, good play from my ADC there. That was beautiful. That was actually really, really good for him to be aware and see that that gank was coming. Really bad my mid fights though. Like at the exact same time my mid lane is fighting. That makes no sense. Oh shit. Why is he here? That's crazy. I must have walked over some kind of ward or something. I'm trying to see. Yeah, my, that Scotty just left the waves. That's crazy. It's cool that he ganked, but he's missing. He missed a wave of farm for it, which is super strange. I think he did. If he rotated straight over after clearing the wave, I'll be mind blown because that makes absolutely zero sense. There's no world where you would walk straight to that. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? Looking at builds, trying to see who's squishy. Their tier is not squishy. <laughs> Their tier is most definitely not squishy. He's all fizzed up. 
Which is fine. That sucks. I really wanted that free invade. Yo. Just gonna keep stance swapping a little bit to maintain my HP. One of the other perks of being Ama, like just the ability to do that is nuts. We're really just trying to power farm. We want 20 early. This whole these warrior builds, it's it's wild to be like, oh warrior comes online late game. They when you're going axe build, both axes do indeed come online late game. They they are nuts like it. We can get beads now. Um please don't die. No shot, nice. I'm just oom. I'm gonna disengage from that because I'm oom. I'm gonna push this wave. My triple on case dead. So we can grab this wave and the next wave. Get a little bit of pressure. I think purple might be up too, actually. Um. Okay, he stayed. That's ridiculous. Yeah, I mean, you stayed for no reason. That was stupid. Nice. <laughs> Get a free little purple buff. And now I don't have to take his wave either. Yeah, no. Because he'll make it there. Completed. This Scotty, when her three is down, she is so fast. Oh, it's wing shard. I'm like, she's so fast, but it's absolutely, it's wing shard. <laughs> That's doing all the work. That's crazy. So we're going to Kins next. I'm going to grab beads. The beads is mainly for the tier and this, maybe the Savannah. I can also pre beads little things like knockups or ice uh, from the enemies. But realistically, I think that I will just be using it for tier. We do need walls. We need the walls. I've been these items finished. Once Kins is finished, I should just shred. Go gank this guy. Gank. Ultimate is down. Whoa there, buddy. Not a lie, that was that was scary for like half a second. Nice engagement actually. Uh, melted. We're gonna disengage a little bit. I'm gonna disengage here. This fight's weird. We let that tier get a ton of distance. And honestly, they're still looking, which is crazy. I'm gonna back and just try to get back to this. I can be here really, really quick. What's my Poseidon's coming out of base? Like we're quick moving right now. 602 movement speed with no speed buff. This is the one thing staying in long fights like this is stupid and I'm talking about the enemy team right now We just reset and we're back here already I'm gonna keep the movement speed buff for the boys Good play he noticed Now we're gonna swap over to damage for the boys I'm ice. No, that ice. Nice kill. I'm down. We got both of his actives. That ice, though, man. That was annoying. Live, 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 live. We need to reset. reset. Unfortunate. Man, if they don't make it so Contagion doesn't do damage, uh, at some point, I think we're all going to lose our minds. The fact that Contagion now does damage, a defense item that's meant for defense and survivability does free damage, and then they gave... <laughs> The game brawler's beat stick a circle that falls on the ground and gives everyone a little bit of power. At max level, it gives everyone 30 power. Um, hi, Riz. Are you drunk? The defensive item that a, you know, a tank gets does damage, but the damage item buffs my teammates? 
Wouldn't you think that the defense item will be better off buffing the teammates? Who did my speed, by the way? We killed Bill. Was it tier? Is it soul? It had to have been soul. It 100% had to have been soul. Attack the gold Defend the fire giant. Attack the gold I hate when people use their pushback like that. Our clear is just insane. Look at Amma's. Just the buff you give and everything on Amma is nuts. Good job, guys. Great play. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 gameplay, boys. Green's on the ground. The soul has been very weird in these team fights because she dies instantly. I don't know why you rumpled that. I'm just being annoying. Being annoying, trying at level 20. Don't want to miss any farm, really. That's the overall goal here. Uh, I don't know if this tier is killable. I'd like to think he is, but Bluestone is just nuts, so I'm not not sure here. He's also very tanky with the wing blade. He died in mid. Yeah, move. I'm dead. That's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, I think. Wait, you cornered yourself. We're they're gonna get fire off this. Yeah, this is really bad. Really, really bad. They're gonna go big fire. Yep, there they go, big fire. That's all from fighting in mid. I can't tell you how many games are thrown from my mid laners W king at people in the mid lane for no reason. It's so weird. Go in, go in. He's not gonna make it in time. It's already done. Don't be this guy. Don't don't be this guy. Don't be this guy, people. Please, you can't get picked in mid for fighting for no reason over no objective and then be afraid to go into the fire giant like that. You cannot. Is this guy coming for this? All right, we need to we need to make sure we don't get caught up here and just lose because I have to I got to get these items online to really test this. We're going dominance now and then more than likely I'll be going into XE. I think I'm so, it's so frustrating, man. That tier is really far up defending a fat wave and we could kill him. Easy pick. There's no way he can get away if two people show up and instead we fight in mid and get caught. Uh, what I'll do here though is I'll split push. A lot of the times you you really see these major buffs done like Fire Giant, Gold Fury, whatever. You can get a lot on the opposite side of the map. So they should be going to the right side of the map, technically, if they're playing correctly. And when they do, I want to pressure out this side of the map. Um, they all show up here, I'm going to die though. I'm going to be real with you guys. They all show up here, I'm probably dead. I don't see them, so this is risky. There's Sylvanas. Sylvanas is that deep, I don't think anyone's over here. Did you just get picked again? There's no world where you play up on the side of the map away from Fire Giant here. Okay. You're fighting a Fire Giant team. Please back off. I'm committed to this. I don't want to trade out a Phoenix here. I'm going to try to. Oh, tears here. Run it back. Face me. Defend. What we're gonna do is we're gonna loop under here and we're gonna back. Gank. That scared me. I'm not gonna lie to you. This sword Attack. Is quite is down. Help. My soul burns bright. One of the good guys got killed. <laughs> We are melting. We are melting. I'm dead. We were melting. Oh my gosh, this stellar burst is hit me for 900. This soul stellar burst is hit me for 900. 
What? His Radiance at 600, which was my fault for sanding it, but that Starburst at 900 damage. That's crazy, dude. What, what is this? Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Nice. Oh my gosh. His soul is hitting so hard. Why is those two hit for that hard? Why does a god who's buffed for auto attacking a lot do it? Okay, okay, okay. That's a kill. Nice. Sucks we lost both Phoenixes though. I'm gonna have to focus the soul. I think I can insta kill her now. Now once I'm 20 and I get this uh, axe of animosity. But I have to focus the soul. I it's gonna be I have to dodge teller burst if it's hitting for 900 to trade to win that trade. That's crazy. Why are we chasing? Retreat! Defend! I don't like chasing her. I think it's terrible because we aren't touching the soul. Retreat! <laughs> now we're retreating. <laughs> Y'all are crazy, dude. Yes, we do. All right, we have the Axe of Animosity online. Finally get to test this item out. Unfortunate it's in these situa this situation, but you know, maybe we can, maybe we can make the most of it. I don't know. Fire is coming up. It's not enhanced. I don't know if we can actually defend it. I think high res needs to take teleport out of the game. I'm gonna be honest. I think teleport is so stupid. I hear a tear, but I don't know if I hear my tear. Yeah, I heard my tear. All right. I hear something, but I don't know what I'm hearing. Um, looks like there's no buffs up. I'm gonna get this deep ward out just for once they get fire. This guy's funny. He thinks he can catch me. <laughs> I don't know if we can defend this. I don't know if we should defend this. Really? Why? I, got, I don't understand this at all. This is just weird. Like fire is up and you guys are staring at me. This is not normal. We're defending this. So this is an all in right here. This means we're letting the right towers just push in. No, I need help. No. Oh, it's unfortunate. I actually had a really good grouping there with them running for me. There we go. Poseidon does that a little bit earlier. I live. My Poseidon was up like at the fire giant. My Shibalanke had to back. I know because he got aggressed on. So I don't blame him backing to base. But if we were collapsing on them when they tried to collapse on Shibalanke, I think we win this game. Now I don't get to test my damage, man. I didn't get the auto at all there in that last fight. That is so unfortunate. I'm sad. I'm very sad. That's probably game here. Uh, but we'll see. It's potentially not. They might not go for the full end and maybe we can get a defense off. I want to go XE and grab a little more pen. But I also don't. <laughs> I kind of want to go like Aussie, maybe get some attack speed, but I, I'm CC'd so much that realistically the best item here is a Magi's Blessing. Uh, Berserker Shield would not be bad. It would keep me alive a little bit longer, but it wouldn't defend me against the soul at all. So it's kind of irrelevant. I could also go Toxic Blade. Which would be nuts, but I'm gonna I'm gonna go XE. Garish, don't you think? All right, let's see what we can do here, boys. Us, dear Phoenixes. Retreat, right lane. Yeah, they should be left though. Defend left lane. I don't know, but it's can't go up there. Too risky. Your left tower is under too risky in a situation like this where I can't get full build, um, or if I think I can't get full build, I'm gonna grab a red potion. We'll grab a red pot just to give that extra damage for the final fight. Red's pushed out pretty far. There's a good chance they just come right though. We need wards. Aussie might have been nice. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sold on a late game Aussie with with uh, this build. It's got a lot of power on it though, which would be valuable. Retreat right lane. No reason to be up that far. There's zero value out of it. They should be going right to regreen the Phoenixes, but it also makes sense for them to be on that left tower 
and get as much as I can in the left tower. It sucks because I'm gonna be honest with you, these builds just don't compete with the bluestone jungle builds right now. It's like it's not even not even close. My soul burns bright. That's a good word from them. Wish we had a counter word here. Might be able to trade with their tier a little bit now. If if I had XE, I definitely could. Oh shit. Nice. Okay. We're good. We're okay. It's actually nuts. Kill him. Nice. Not nice. I need to live. That's a good heal from them. He's dead to the tower. <gasps> Why did it swap off of him? What? There's no world that should have swapped off of him. Come on, yeah, hit an auto, buddy. Um, All right, I hit the tanks hard. That's without XE. Whew, we got Scotty back. She does a lot of ability damage, so going for the kill in her is a little pointless. It's not. I'm not going to gain much out of it. Honestly, I'm going to go XE. I'm going XE here. I need to be able to... I can kill the soul. And I think I can kill that Scotty like instantly. That was a great play from who... I think my... Because I, by the way, pushed him in the Phoenix there. But I need to be able to kill that Sylvanas in the mix of that fight. Because he was very tanky. Crazy to me they only got one Phoenix. Oh, yeah. We're feeling the attack speed now, boys. We're feeling it. I can sell Golden Blade still, too. I think Golden Blade will probably go for Oboe. Or Aussie. Or maybe a Blood Forge. But I like the attack speed with this build. So probably an, an Oboe. Oh, yeah. Wait. They need to be here. Come on. Burn. She missed her ult. And yes, Kraken. Kill him. Yes. The house of the Phoenix. I'm gonna go defend. Help. I got the Titan, boys. But chill. Nice. Did we just win this? Is that a comeback? That was a. We destroyed that fire giant, by the way. We destroyed that fire giant. If we were grouped up earlier, if our Poseidon wasn't doing red, which I, I get getting ready one of the extra damage, but if he's there instantly, I think we insta kill that fire. Okay, bro, you cannot get picked in this situation, pal. Just back to base. You're being greedy. No reason to go mid there, ever. No reason. Notice how I got out. As soon as I realized I lived, I got out right away and I backed. I was gone. There was no chance I was going to die after living with one health. You got to take your wins. You guys got to stop being greedy. You got to stop tunnel visioning down kills. You have to realize a reset is very, very valuable. Um, you just got to play smarter. Is this enhanced? Oh, it's enhanced. He's getting melted. He's getting melted. I'm gonna die, please! Why is my Shibalaki on top of me?
There's no reason my Shibalakes, instead of hitting the tower, he ran up in the melee range with me to try to kill the tier. He completely threw there. When you are ranged, play range. You throw games doing little things like this. Like that, in my mind, from my like from my experience and the amount I played the game, what he just did is terrible. He could have just double cracked it and ended the game right there. By the way, he could have just double cracked both of them, instant killed them, and saved the whole game. It doesn't matter. We're resetting now, even though we should have won. But signing got picked. And then secondly, as an ADC, sit in the back and press left click. Stop overthinking it. Stop using abilities to do crazy stuff. Just sit back, AFK, left click. Hit whoever's in front of you. Because I swear, every time I see a squishy mage ADC or, you know, melee, or sorry, sorry, uh, magic carry, go into melee range, you instant die. Stop doing it. It's stupid. It is stupid. If I could do that, the damage that you can do from range, I would never run into melee range. As a melee, like, as someone who plays melee most of the time. It's crazy. I know it was X-Ball trying to make, like, the I'm going to finish this this tier. We're going to end the game. But you have to be aware of who's alive. The Pele is still alive. A bunch of them just respawned. Soul was still alive. It's a terrible idea to go for that. With not much to gain, sadly. I'm going to back in my 3K pot group up. I'm gonna grab two regular wards here too. It should be all we need, to be honest. Um, I think we go for gold here. We just styled on them pretty hard. Got a lot of poke off. Now we go in. Nice. Nice. Bailey bind, Bailey bind, Bailey bind, Bailey bind. Good Aegis. Oh, they just got. We fought well today, my friends. That's crazy. They used Scotty ult, Soul ult, Pele ult. And Pele chased me. And while they, Pele was chasing me after they used their ult, we backed off with tier ult um, and Poseidon ult. I might be able to defend, but it's going to be very, very difficult. Your middle Phoenix is under attack. Uh, they end so fast. Oh, GG. We fought well the Titan just doesn't die. Look at how fast this Titan dies. Look at this. Look at how fast this Titan dies, bro. This thing should have like triple the HP it has right now. It's crazy. I tried. I tried so hard. This build is nuts late game. It is insane how hard carry it is late game. But goodness gracious, the amount of throwing coming out in season 10 is insane. Besides it through getting caught in mid. Um, and something happened right after that. We pushed right and something weird happened. I don't remember what happened. I don't know if... Uh, if we just weren't grouped or what, it might have been just because Poseidon was still picked, but we threw so hard. And then right there in mid, that was a hard, hard, hard throw in mid. No world are you backing off of a tier 2 tower when they're that poked out. Let's see the damage. Yeah, okay. Shimalanke was trying to pump, but he was feeding his brains out. Uh, nice wards, because Embo played great. He almost out damaged by mid and did more damage by soul inner. Better jungler. Yeah, dude, you're just, you're just beasting it up, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Blue stone and casuals, you're nuts. Keep it up. Nice. Um, yeah, so stop inting, stop diving as ranged characters, and please just play smarter. Stop W King kills, stop chasing things you don't need to chase. Play smart, play grouped up, play around your objectives. Your games won't end up like this. I can't tell you if you go look through my ranked history, I have like I think out of my 20 some losses, I have 15 or 16 of them are thrown games like at the Phoenix at, at objectives thrown games. Slow down your mind guys. Stop getting tunnel visioned. If someone gets out, it's okay for someone to live with one health. It doesn't matter. If someone lives with one health. What matters is 
you're attacking somebody in front of you and not chasing somebody 10 miles away from you. It'll make your games way better. Hope you guys liked the video. If you did, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you like the videos, and I'll see you in the video tomorrow, the next day, the next day, and the next day.